I know you're doing the best you can today. All your efforts will pay off as long as you keep moving forward. You will get stronger. I believe in you. Just be kind to one another. You'll be thankful for it in the future. Now, let's go kill some wizards. <laughs> Alright everybody, welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy where we are going to just knock out all of these uh, question things because, well, we need to. So we're going to start, we're going to start off with the beautiful Poppy today. So let's go locate this on the map. In the Forbidden Forest. Um, okay, so we're going to fast travel there. So we wrapped up with, uh, spoilers, if you haven't seen the previous episode, please go do that. <laughs> why haven't, why are you here instead of watching the previous one? <laughs> uh, our Lod Gok died. Because Ranrock was his brother, which I was not aware of at all, actually. That was a surprise. And, um, yeah, Sebastian, we may be losing Sebastian slowly. And we're going to have a choice, I bet. We're going to have a choice to save and or not. So which means we're going to have to either choose the Keepers or Sebastian's side of the story. Which, um... I'm not sure what to do. Guys, let me know. What is the best ending that you can get in the game? Please let me know in the comments down below. And I guess we just go up this way. Sorry, I'm messing with my hat. <laughs> there we go. Uh, yeah, up here. I'm so curious how... I, I see the ending coming, like we're going to have to choose, but I don't actually don't know how it's going to end with Ranrock. I have no clue. Ooh. Where are we meeting, Poppy? This, ooh, is that a, oh, there's an owl. Why are you out here in the night all by yourself? I can do this. I can do this. Yes, you Will can. To help. You can, Poppy. I is believe in you. Is this where we're meeting the centaurs? Well, they don't exactly know we're coming, so it's less of a meeting and more of a surprise, hopefully, I suppose. Hopefully they don't take it like an ambush. Um, mm, they won't like it, but I think they'll understand after we explain ourselves. But we're going to be supportive. Once we tell them about the snidgets, they'll understand why we came and they'll want to help. I hope you're right. Perhaps they'll be yeah, able you're to the one who told tell me that. that we're sincere. There's something about them that's so knowing. It's almost unnerving. Because they use the stars to see the future. Don't know any more than us. I mean, the centaurs are known for being... Yeah, they're known I for suppose being they are known for having an air of omniscience. That's exactly the right word. I just... never mind. It's okay, it? Poppy, I get it's it. It's nothing, truly. I've... we've no secrets to hide. That's right. I mean, I've got we'll a couple. simply be honest with them about what we're trying to do. They'll have to help us, won't they? Yes, of course. You're absolutely right. I... but We'll I, meet with uh... them, tell them about the Snidgets, and I'm sure to all be fu- Hello. Alright, Poppy, let's see your composure here. Let's put the wand away, dude. What do you think you're doing here, humans? Please! We were hoping to speak with you. Ah! I suppose you'd like a tale for your friends of the time you spoke to a centaur and it spoke back. No! Never! We're here because we need your help. Enough! You made a grave error in judgment in coming here, little witch. Uh, nerdy, do something. Leave them be, Alec. We do not harm the young. It is not our way. You forget your place, old fool. I'm the leader of this herd, and while you cling to our way, their kind continues to slaughter beasts like us without a care. From what I can see, they have slaughtered no one. They will leave here unharmed. The guy's Jack Mark being my old words, one. Doran. If I ever see them again, it will be all three of your heads. 
but but we 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 still need your help, dudes. Foolish children. Do you know what happens to wizards who wander here? Now. Follow me before Golden I... Golden Snidgets are still alive, and the poachers are after them. They know that the key to finding them lies in the moonlight, but they don't know what that means, yet. Please help us find the Snidgets before the poachers do. Could it be... In the south, there is a cave within which lies what the poachers seek, a moonstone. Retrieve it and place it in the henge in the forest. I, on the other hand, must go speak with the herd. Find me after you have done this. Huh. That was scary, but easier than I thought it would be. I to don't understand. So the moonlight mentioned in the journal doesn't refer to actual moonlight, but to a moonstone. What do moonstones have to do with Snidgets? And why was he so certain about where we could find one? Is it moonstone common? Isn't moonstone all around us? Why retrieve one from a cave? Knowing centaurs, I suspect he's referring to a specific moonstone. We'll likely know it when we see it. True. Uh, no, he was not annoyingly cryptic. Uh, I don't know, things. but I am inclined to believe him, what with his being a centaur and all. I am too. It is a shame how quickly he left. What was his name? Doran. Doran. That's what the leader of the herd called him. Well, if Doran knows something we don't, I'd rather act now and ask questions later. I can head to the library and start looking into the cave he mentioned. The library? No, just go to the cave. I'll let you know what I find. We, we, you're not, mm, poppy. Okay. Fine, we'll be that way. Go back to the school. I'm going to do another quest while you do that. A basis for blackmail. Oh, no. Natty sent me another owl saying that she can sneak away without her mother knowing. And to meet her outside Hogsmeade. Uh, let's see what happens to this one. Um, I'm just going to fast travel to not Hog, uh, Hogsmeade. Hogsward, Hogsmeade. There, there, there's so many hogs. I'm going to fast travel to Hogsmeade, then walk over there because it's closer. I think. Also, guys, make sure you press like and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. It definitely helps out the channel. Uh, yes, speak with Natty outside. Okay, 100 meters. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, definitely helps support the channel and helps support what I do. I greatly appreciate it. 60, 50. Are you... I hate this whole sneaky business. What trouble are we going to get Nat into? I have to wait. Fine, I'll wait. I mean, you were Are waiting you on ready me to for put a long time. To Halo? Uh, a little bit, but um, I'm ready to do what's needed to take Harlow down. I know you have a plan. We must gather information from the friends of Mr. Bickle that Archie and Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Agabus Filbert, Otto Dibble, and Mr. and Mrs. Rib. All right. I suggest that Wait, you speak with kind each of on them our side now. while I head we to the hogshead. I saw some ashwinders heading there. And as my mother would never go near the hogshead, she is less likely to learn of my activities than if I were to wander the village questioning its residents. But, okay, but we actually, in the last episode, Rookwood turned on Ranrock. So, is this mission like a little behind now? Outdated, I guess? What sort of information am I trying to gather from these people? They may know what evidence Mr. Bickle had against Harlow, or they may have evidence of their own. We simply need to know whatever they know. Easier said than done. Where am I to find these friends of his? I do not know about Mr. Rib, but his wife, Daisy, is often in Hogsmeade, as is Agabus Filbert. And Otto Dibble, he works at Gladrags, so you will likely find him there. Cool, cool. Very well. I'll speak with them, see what I can learn. 
I knew I could rely on you. We need to know how they are being blackmailed by Rookwood and Harlow. Meet me here after you have spoken with them. Yeah, I'm not sure if this Hopefully is even relevant anymore. by the time anymore. you return, I will be able to move a bit more freely. Speak with Daisy, speak with Otto, speak with Agabus. And they're all in a Hogsmeade, okay. Yeah, I think this is, mission's a little outdated. But we'll find out. Uh, this is still targeting Rookwood's right-hand man, not actually Rookwood, so... Uh, maybe there's, uh... Ooh, ooh, I have not pet you yet. We haven't seen a new kitty in a while. Here we go. <laughs> Who's a good boy? You are. Still best game for allowing you to pet your pets. Although, we don't have a pet, and that's very discouraging. I would love, like, my own animal in this game. I feel like it should be an option. Oh, you're up there. Okay. Mrs. Rape should be nearby. Yeah, we'll see if this is outdated or not. Oh, oh Isco, what have I done? What have you done? Mrs. Rabe, I wondered if I might speak with you about Theophilus Harlow. I'm a friend of the Bickles and I'm trying to gather evidence against him. Poor Joanna and little Archie. And now Harlow has taken my darling Isco. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> I'm a security guard at Gringotts, and my husband is a curse breaker for them. Harlow approached me about helping him extort my colleagues into giving him treasures from the vaults. And you declined? Of course I declined. Repeatedly. I thought they'd given up until I came home one night and found my husband gone and a note affixed to my door with a knife. The oh. note stated that I only had a few days to reconsider helping with some banking needs and that my husband would appreciate it if I acted quickly. Mm. But the help Harlow wants is help that I cannot give. And my dearest Isco is paying the price. Mm. I mean, I'm pretty sure that note confirms kidnapping. Um. Have you helped Harlow since your husband was taken? No. I'm worried sick about Isco, but he'd never want me to compromise my integrity. I also know that he's extremely clever. That said, I was hoping he would have escaped by now. It makes me concerned as to why he hasn't. Why wouldn't Harlow extort your husband? Isco's job is even more removed from the vaults than mine. He travels the world for the bank. He could do nothing for Harlow. I'm the one in the bank on a daily basis, which evidently makes me an enticing target for blackmail. Thank you, Mrs. Rabe. Knowing the lengths that Harlow will go to is helpful, albeit more than disturbing. Mr. Bickle was trying to help us, but now he's gone. I don't know what to do. I shall do all I can to get evidence against Harlow, Mrs. Rabe. Very well. Here's the note I received. You must be careful as well. Please don't put yourself in danger. <laughs> uh, Miss Rabe, we do hope you reconsider helping us with our banking needs. We've given you ample time to reach a decision on your own, but we are beginning to lose our patience. We know your husband would appreciate it if you were to see the value in our working together. Shall we expect a response by week's end? Best to keep this between us if you understand our meaning. Some evidence worth hanging on to. Well, Thank you. Need a drink for that one? I hope it's not too late. Now, to find Mr. Bickle's other two friends. Okay. We may be wasting our time with this, but we'll quickly make it up. Come on, Poppy. Uh, give us another side mission. Oh, we can run in here. It just wouldn't let me. Four. Okay. That's bright. I love all the Christmas trees that they decorated around this place. And in Hogwarts, too. I love it all. Now. Uh, where is... Otto Dibble works at Gladrax. I should check there. Wait, are you behind? The... You're behind. Oh. 
Uh, p -p -p please oh. tell me you didn't take it, but perhaps it's been here. Mr. Dibble, may I speak with you? It's about Theophilus Harlow. I have nothing to say about him. Uh, may I interest you in a stunning cravat today? Please, sir, I'd like to help. I spoke to Mrs. Bickle. <laughs> you know the Bickles? Mm, all right. But we must be discreet. Can't have Mr. Hill hearing this. I know Mr. Hill. He was kind to me the day of the troll attack. Oh, he's a good man. But even he wouldn't understand about Harlow. It started a few weeks ago. I was distracted, reading a note, when you-know-who came into the shop. For the I had the note behind the counter and offered to help him. He stared at me for a moment, then asked me to check on an order he'd placed. I went into the storeroom to check on what turned out to be a non-existent order. When I returned, he was holding the note. What was in the note? It was a note from Rosie Hill, Mr. Hill's daughter. You see, we've been, well, secretly engaged these past six months. We haven't told Mr. Hill yet. I dare say he has higher hopes for her. Harlow advised me in no uncertain terms that my relationship with Rosie, not to mention my employment here, depended upon my cooperation. What does he ask you to do? It all happened so quickly. In an instant, he took a very expensive scarf from the counter, pocketed it, and smiled. He said, your secret is safe as long as I can supply my lady friend with delightful items like this every Ooh. so often. I've been able to cover for his requests until now with some creative bookkeeping, but I can't keep it out for much longer. I'm terrified to say anything. I could never live without Rosie. Ooh. Mr. Hill seems a fair man. Can you tell him? Hmm. I met Mr. Hill the day of the troll attack. He was kind to me. Why don't you just tell him? He's a lovely man. But when it comes to Rosie, I fear he loses all perspective. He'd see this as a grave betrayal. I'd lose my job instantly, and Rosie as well. Hmm, I could see that. What have you been doing to keep the extortion a secret? Well, as I mentioned, creative bookkeeping. And I've also been trying to cover the costs with my own savings, but I'm running out of money. Ooh, of course, okay. none of this bodes well for my efforts to improve my circumstances and to be worthy of Rosie. Oof, so there... So he's actually paying for everything out of pocket. Could you give me a bit more detail about the note? That might help me to identify it should I come across it. It's on Rosie's special pink stationery. It has her monogram at the top, R.H. That's how Mr. Hill would know it was real. Thank you for telling me. I'm gathering evidence to take Harlow down. I would love nothing more than to see him rotting in Azkaban, but be careful. He's an awful man and incredibly dangerous. As for Rosie's letter, should you happen upon it, I have committed it to memory. You may destroy it immediately. Do we have to Understood. find that letter, actually? Now hurry off before Mr. Hill returns. Where was I? We're on the right track. Now to find the last of Mr. Bickle's friends. There's no way going that way. Okay, so... I don't... I mean, I guess we're getting evidence to take Harlow down. But Rookwood's turn. Do we need to do this? Beep, beep, coming through. I want to get to the more meaty part of the story, like Sebastian. Hmm. Run, 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 run. Philbert must be around here somewhere. Hello there. Hello. Excuse me, Mr. Philbert. I wondered if I might speak with you about your dealings with Theophilus Harlow. I hope to ease Mrs. Bickle's mind by gathering evidence against him. Oh, tragic what happened to Bickle. He wanted me to speak out against Harlow for an act of violence committed against me. But I feared Harlow's retaliation, and so I refused. Uh, you should have spoken out. You're wise to not speak out. I mean, it's a moral choice and, like, a smart choice. Hmm... You may have shared Mr. Bickle's fate if you had spoken out against Harlow as he requested. Unfortunately, I suspect you're right. You said that Harlow committed an act of violence against you. Could you tell me what happened? Before my extraordinary wife, Dulcibella, passed away, she had just completed a small book of poetry. 
as a surprise for her birthday, one she never had the chance to celebrate, I had the book beautifully bound and plated in gold. One day, Harlow came calling to punish me for having spoken out against the Neanderthals that comprise Rookwood's lot. Before I knew it, I'd been petrified, and Harlow was rifling through my home. He found the book of poetry with its exquisite gold plating. Like, like, I watched petrified? helplessly, lying there in my entranceway as he scared. walked away with the book, laughing as he went. I was shaken to my core. Still am, to be honest. I imagine you fear Harlow retaliating again. But do you mind if I share this information with Officer Singer? <sighs> I suppose I have no choice. This extortion can't go on forever. You can pass it on to anyone who may be willing to help. Good. Harlow does not like people talking, as you already know. Oh, yeah, You're we definitely already Mr. know. Mr. Bickle's friends. Now to find Natty. Natty, where could she be? Return to Natty. Okay, so back to the front of uh, Hogsmeade, I'd assume. Yeah, let's just knock this quest out and see where it gets us. I'm finally, finally learning the layout for Hogsmeade. It's taken a while, but uh, it. Like, the map for this game is so huge. I'm it's impressed. It's not like Natty to be late. She said she was going to the Hog's Head. Perhaps I'll find her there. Oh my goodness, did you really make me go down there just to all the way run back? Ugh. Game, why? Why would you do this to me? Uh... Natty must be around here somewhere. Ooh, chest. Natty's wand. She can cast without it. She wanted me to find this. She's in trouble. Yeah, I was gonna Revelia say that's where she she's was in taken. Trouble. Revelio. Her? Ah, oh, it's up there. Okay. Okay, this is a little bit more dangerous now. No, we got Nat in trouble. Shoot, we got Nat in trouble. Uh, which is what we kind of didn't want to happen. Uh oh, spaghettios. Wait, what? Where are we going? Natty must have been taken this way. I need to find her quickly. How do you know she was? She's in the cellar. I don't know how you put those two brain cells together. The footprints led to this room. Oh, footprints. There must be another way forward. Uh, it looks like there is. Um. Revelio. Okay, so we just, uh... Accio. Let's pull these both and see what happens. A hidden door. Fatty like, must have been taken this way. It's like Hufflepuff common room. I need to find her quickly. Except, unlike Hufflepuff Common Room, I can use my unforgivable curses on anybody in here. I'm going straight to the Hogshead. Or perhaps I'll just. Going straight to Hogshead? No, no, no. You're going straight to Azkaban. Or the Grave. One of the two. Depending what I decide to do here. Probably Azkaban. I'd better be sure. Because I don't I'm not know seen. about a cadaver yet. It's not arrogance, it's uh, recklessness. <laughs> wow, they actually have me down to a T. They kidnapped her just to get to me, which is what I specifically was worried about with Natty. Oh boy. But, since we know that they're expecting me, let's give them the surprise attack by actually showing up. I shall be having none of you nonsense. Hmm. 
I want, I want to do this. What was that sound? I know, I'm not hearing things. You is hearing things though. You didn't see anything. Don't come any closer. Oh, they're really on guard. Nothing. Again. Good. Okay, now it's been a bit grim, I won't deny, but the tide will turn for us soon. This guy. Oh, you're not dead. Okay. We're ringing the bell here. Fight for me. Oh. Oh. Um. Aha! Back for more. Wait, no, you're on my team. My bad. Oh, shoot! Lightning! We have a bigger Thor in here. Oh, your thoughts are full, man. There's a furry in here? Can't okay, cabbages go go go? Okay, get rid of one. There's a lot of people in here right now. You need some damage done. You're gonna hurt a lot. Ooh. Barely felt any business. Quite conductive, aren't we? Hey, stop it! Whoa. Arrest the momentum. Oh, you're going to regret that. Am I? Um. Confringo. Get that again. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Oh. Hmm. Goodbye. Sheep. Ooh, that had to hurt, didn't it? Uh, we need to get rid of gear. Ugh. There we go. Ooh, unidentified outfit. Good thing I actually Rebellion. searched through. Ooh. Oh, so many things collecting here. Oh, you are as dear to me as Algari, whose voice foretells the coming rain. You are as loved by me as a corrupt could be. Whose loyalty is true and plain. You have cast a spell over my heart. I want it not undone. You have changed me from the very start. You have always been the one. Oh, was Look that the supposed to rhyme? Was taken from Agabus Felbert. He'll be thrilled to have this back. Was, was that supposed to rhyme? I'm still trying to figure that part out. Ooh, a. Grap horns. When do we get a grap horn? That's what the thing is called that I saw in the trailer. Or the ga demo gameplay. Unidentified hand item. Got that there. Do, do, do. So much going on in here. Unidentified hand item. What's over here? Revelio. 
I guess I was supposed to sneak attack those that yeah, there's a lot of uh, like sneak around ways in here. Am I supposed to explore this part? Or is this like just like the back way that I could have taken? Revelio. Came all the way back here just for 40 coins. I've done less. Optional, find Auto Dobby's love letter. I did that, right? Or I guess find the rest of it. Can't get in there. Here we go. Is this another way through? Seems I could have snuck my way through. Maybe. Yeah, I could have snuck my way around. I didn't have to fight all of them. Oh well, we did. That he must be here somewhere. Oh. You found us. I knew you would realize I had left my one for you. Speak to Mr. Rabe. He will tell you what you need to do. Hey, hey coins. <laughs> oh? Revelio. I heard something. Alohomora. Oh. A lot. Okay. Alright, what's in here? Oh! His wand. Okay. Oh. You first, I guess. Mr. Rabe! Daisy told me you've been abducted. You spoke with my wife. How is she? Worried about you. Are you alright? I am alright. Thank you for coming. These locks are cursed. And there's an anti-apparition jinx on the cells. Even Natty's skill with wandless magic cannot free us. I need you to find my wand. I... Mr. Rabe, I found your wand. That was well hard. done. I knew it was nearby. Now, you best stand back. One never knows how a curse will react to being broken. True. Let's step away. Do it. Oh. I think I've done a bigger curse than that. You just did a simple basic attack. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Isco. My pleasure. And thank you, my friend. We owe our lives to your bravery. I may be too weak to disapparate with you both, but I can try. Mm. You go ahead. Find Officer Singer. We will get out of here on our own. Is that Very well. splint? But be careful. Splinched. What was the term? Thank you, my young friend. Be prepared for a fight. These Ashwinders must pay. That's a little bit angry. Find a way out. We just go the way we came. They're all dead, right? Yeah, I think it took care of everybody. So, uh, <laughs> uh... Ooh, more coins. Thank you. Oh, just one. Rebellion. Okay, we can't go that way. I guess we'll go... There's more chests in here. What the heck? I guess I'll come back for that, though. I'm gonna get through this mission. Then get back to the main story. Let's find Officer Singer and put an end to Harlow once and for all. Uh, but what? how does this affect the story with Rookwood? Oh, man. Can you really mess up the story? Or, like, not go through the story truly? Oh, hello, Zinger. Lovely day, isn't it? Natsai Onai. I should have known. And you, the troll dispatcher. That's me. Oh, thank goodness the two of you are safe. 
Isco Rabe told me a couple of students had rescued him. Should have known it was you two. Is Mr. Rabe all right? He is. I sent him home to his wife. Miss Onai, your mother will not be pleased to learn that you're still risking your safety pursuing these dangerous men. Actually, Officer Singer, Natty and I learned of several Hogsmeade residents who've had their lives threatened by the Ashbinders. In addition to abducting Mr. Rabe to blackmail his wife and Natty, Rookwood and Harlow have also extorted Agabus Filbert and Otto Dibble. Uh, I will look into all of that. As for the two of you, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but you are taking great risk. Next time, please let the authorities handle the Ashwinders. Uh, I don't want to be totally disrespectful, but they haven't been doing much. And she doesn't sound very, very helpful. Hmm. I'm not, I'm not going to sit back and just let them lose this, you know? Ah. My character in this game, I feel like, would say understood yes, but then keep on doing it. Yes, officer. Do you have enough evidence to take down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot? Well, it's certainly a good start. We shall see. But you can leave this to me now. Can we, though? Can we? Natsai, you may wish to speak with your mother about this before I do. My mother will not like this. Thank you again for rescuing me. Yeah, Nat, you went and got yourself captured. I rescued you. Now, Hogsmeade, here I come. For the next story, is there going to be like a mail or anything? Oh, Siamese! The bestest one! Yeah, who's a good boy? You are! The best one right here, Siamese. What I've always been wanting. Oh. I know, you're a good boy. It's now quest time. Um, uh, in the shadow of hope. So now we're gonna go to Sebastian. Uh, Sebastian has a plan to talk to Anne without Solomon knowing and wants to meet me outside the hamlet. Mm. Complete the finer. Oh, we have the final keeper trial. Okay, so we'll do in the shadow of hope and then the uh, final trial. And that's way down. Way, yeah, way down here. Oh, Sebastian, Sebastian. Ugh. In the Shadow of Hope, is this where... When do we learn about a cadaver? Uh, I needed to learn that for uh, science purposes. <laughs> you know, just saying. I wonder who lives here. Sebastian does. Sebastian... Oh, gosh, major lag. Oof, that hurt. Sebastian, hey! Are you going to get us into more trouble? I am getting myself into a lot of trouble, aren't I? I wasn't at first, but, uh, hey, it's sort of, uh, unraveling to be this way. Oh, Sebastian, you are... a lost relic from a catacomb which requires a dark sacrifice. Wait, what? I know how it sounds, but if this can help you, it's worth the risk. Mm. Does Ominous know about this? He helped find the scriptorium where we discovered Slytherin's spellbook. Very well. If Ominous will be there, I'll meet you. We don't have much time. Solomon wants to leave Feldcroft. What? Leave? Never mind. You need to stall him. Buy us time, Anne. Please. I shall do my best. I'll be in touch. Oh no, Sebastian. Solomon can't take Anne from Feldcroft. Where would they go? When would I see her? Sebastian, I can't believe my uncle wants to leave Feldcroft. Anne's going to stall him. She must. We need time. Time? For what? I've learned more about the relic. I cross-reference Slytherin's spellbook with everything in the library on relics and dark sacrifices. That's when I realized something. I believe the relic will only work inside the catacomb. This is more complicated than we thought. Um, we... A dark sacrifice? So we have to get Anne to the catacomb and then conduct a sacrifice. 
Seems risky. It'll be worth the risk. Our biggest hurdle may be convincing Ominous. And we'll only give this a chance if he's on board. And we have to keep all of this from your uncle. If he goes to the headmaster, well, he could be expelled. But, but Let me handle Ominous you're... this time. As for my uncle, he's not an aura anymore. What he doesn't know, well, won't hurt us. But, but Sebastian, it requires a sacrifice. Are you really, really willing to sacrifice someone else to help your sister not feel pain? Oh. Do you think your uncle would tell anyone Sebastian's at the ministry far. about all of this if he found out? If he found out, I doubt he'd go to the ministry. He didn't part ways with them well from what I understand. He won't say, but I believe his strong aversion to dark magic has something to do with his time there. Anne thinks he once decided to fight fire with fire, so to speak, and resorted to using an unforgivable curse and fight against dark wizards. At least that's what she thought she heard. When he realized what his job had led him to become, he left rather abruptly. So, I'm not sure he'd go to the Ministry to report on his own family using dark magic now. Mm. Good luck with Ominous. Until we meet again. I shall let you know when the four of us should meet at the catacomb. Look for my owl. Ooh. See you soon. Sebastian, I, do we have... Wait, is Ominous gonna be the sacrifice? No, we can't let that happen. Ominous, he wants to be away from all this dark magic stuff. How about no one is sacrificed and... But if I remove Anne's pain... Oh... Hmm, then I may lose the Keeper's trust. Well then, let's quickly do the four trials. <laughs> Wait, more undiscovered place that we haven't been? Oh, wow! We're gonna go way over here? Okay then, well. Near the Phoenix? Uh, we'll do that one, because I think the other one's in a cave. Alrighty then. And also, I cannot believe I've been flying brooms wrong this entire time. I finally figured out how to work them properly. It's right trigger, just hold them down. And you fly like this. You don't have to use the boost. I cannot believe I did that. You learn something new every day, right? Ah. <sighs> So I'm guessing we're getting close to the part where it starts deciding the different endings. All I know is there's like three different endings, apparently. Uh, I don't know how to do them. I don't know how to like get each one. I don't know which one it, which each one entails, but I'm assuming it has to do with Sebastian and like either stopping him or going oh, along with like him. I've been at this for hours. Which I'm not okay with, Sebastian. Do not make us Obi-Wan you. Chop off your one arm and two legs. I guess we're gonna go down this way? I, didn't, I did not meet a dragon, so that's a good thing. Professor Fig, what have you been doing this whole time? I'm over what here risking my life now? with all kinds of stuff, you're here. but you're always gone. I have good news. We do not have any of Ranrock's loyalists to continue. Since you saved okay. Mr. Rabe and I from the Ashwinders, we have come so far. We should discuss the next steps in our plan to stop Harlow. Oh, but, but, Professor, find the clue to over open the pins of chain. Revelio, though. Find the clue? You mean just set on fire? Confringo! <laughs> is that a... It is. I believe I know what must be done. Oh, is that... What, a Graphorn's head Do you like? recognize the head sculpted there? I'm not certain. That's a head. I can't say that I do. 
It appears to be a fearsome beast known as a graphorn. Yeah, a graphorn. And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a graphorn will somehow open the way forward. That's oh. what Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of graphorns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next, I can't say. How am I predicting the creatures we uh, meet so on point? I am genuinely surprised, but I love it. So we get a graphorn here? Have you ever subdued a graphorn, Professor? I have, yes. <clears throat> Years ago, at Stonehenge, of all places. The Ministry still owes me for that favor. <laughs> it can be difficult, of course. They are massive, after all. But it's not impossible. It's my experience that many of your spells will have no real effect. Great. You'll need to wear him down. What do you mean by wear him down? If that's what must be done, I'll do it. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. Now, Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. So I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. It's gr great. So I'm going to have to. So we're getting a grab horn, I guess, or subduing one. I'm not sure what that entails, to be honest. Oh, wait, is the nest right here? No, there's no way it's right here. Right now, that's for whoopers? Not jobbernals. Yeah, that's definitely not. Um, search for the Lord of the Shore. Alright, so I'm guessing this way? Wow, that's pretty far away, actually. I was not expecting that. Uh, and honestly, I know nothing about grab horns. I didn't even know they existed in Harry Potter world until this game came out. Not gonna lie. So I'm curious to see like what they are, what they do. What? Oh, excuse me, pardon me. Beep beep. This is pointless. It's not pointless. You're doing a job that you will suffer for eventually. Oh, cows. Uh, watch out for dragons. They will come and uh, eat you. Are you familiar with the hamlet of Irondale? It's south of the castle. I think the cave that Doran wanted us to find is near there. Thank you, Poppy. Uh, we'll do Poppy's thing after this. Is that an astro That is an astronomy thing. Whoa, there is a dead secret. Oh, so that's a loading screen. Oh, the Merlin trial. This must be the place. Yes. Oh, is that a? Oh, that's a danger sign. I thought it was a pirate ship. Anne's worried. She said Sebastian promised her that I would be there if she went to meet him in the catacomb. But now he's asking her to join him immediately and to come alone. She says he doesn't sound himself. Meet us at the catacomb as soon as you can. I hope that my quill has conveyed my message clearly. Sebastian, what are you doing, dude? Sebastian! Into the Graphorn's den? Oh boy. I don't like this at all. I don't know anything about a grab porn. This is like trying to jump in and tame a rhino without knowing how to. And doing just hopping in and doing everything wrong. Very well, Lord of the Shore. Show yourself. Be on your guard, dude. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Oh! I didn't hurt you! No! I don't want to hurt you! 
are you? You're my friend! Why can't we be friends? Ah, that's unavoidable. Why can't we be friends? I can't use the friend get a little curse! <laughs> I can't use any of my unforgivable curses. That's unsettling. Oh, jeez. It's not that. Down, down, puppy. Oh. Oh. Bad puppy. Bad puppy. Bad puppy. Can you slow down a little bit? No, nope, that's not going to work. Oh, jeez. Ouch! I'm not playing toy! Well, I swear, this is what people describe sometimes dog sitting is like. It is exactly that! We're babysitting this thing! Oh. What else hurts you? Uh, let's see here. It was tentacular. That'll hurt. What? That'll help. In the face. There we go. Good. Now over here. Where the plants are. Come on. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? You are! Woo! Okay. Okay. Ah! Yep. Bad puppy! Bad puppy! Pearl. Oh. You are a feisty little guy, I like it. Oh. There was no prompt for that. Good friend though. Can we talk about this? Yeah, can we talk about this, please? I would rather not hurt you. But you clearly have a different opinion on the matter. Poor guy. No. We mean you no harm. You attacked us. Hey, come on. Oh. oh. You're glowing. That's not a good thing. That is not a good thing. What? Oh, Jeez. Whoa. Uh, I didn't think I can take much more of this. I agree. I concur. I really have to worry you on my guard about dodges. Whoa. Didn't that there was no reaction time there. Good for you. I don't have to worry about dodging. Whoa. I I anticipated and I failed. Oh my gosh, I hate this so much. Okay. Rock. No, turn your There's no reaction time to that! Are you kidding me? <gasps> We're almost there, we almost got this. Are you kidding me? I clearly did that even. Uh, no! Oh my gosh, I am dodging those exactly on time. No! Oh my gosh, you have Ah! This is ridiculous. Oh, we have to be so far away. Just keep running away. Oh, that's how you get time. You have to be farther away. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, 
You just have to be very far away. Very far away, which we are not right now. Woo! Ow, that hurt. Okay, it fell down. My bad. Okay, two potions. Use ancient power, quickly. Ugh, took a lot of damage. Good, good, good. Now run away, run away, run away, wait. No, I can't run away. Oops. Run away. Oh. Poor guy. No. Whoa. Major lag. Oh, grab horn. Neil. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I... I need your help, friend. Oh. Oh, he's a good boy. He he just uh he was startled. Oh, what really threw him off was a Hufflepuff being brave. Whoa! I get to ride him? What? I get a oh, I get a ride? The grab horn has a powerful charge attack that deals a lot a large damage, a large amount of damage to enemies in certain barricades. Hold left trigger to initiate, keep an eye on the grab horn's stamina meter as charging will drain it. What no. Oh, and I gotta collect stuff while I'm out here. So like Go! That's cool. Okay, a lot of juices. Do I... Okay, so I can't actually... Faster. Cool! I didn't know we could ride these. Like, when I saw it in the, uh, gameplay trailer, uh, it was in the, uh, Vivarium, in the Room of Requirement. I didn't know you actually get to ride it. This is so cool! Yeah, that's right, we bad. Return to the ground. But, oh my gosh, that's so far away. Can I just fast travel there? Wait. Hang on, because I can... If I... Right, because he's one of... <gasps> yeah, okay, so I can just fast travel there. Cool. Oh, wow, he was literally way down there. Cool. So, does that mean... There's a nest of them down there? Like, if I were to go back, I can get another one? Because I found you can breed hippogriffs. The grab horn is somehow the key to opening the room. Oh, uh, grab horn! Time for a jaunt, I'd say. Charge is unavailable. Oh. Oh! I need to stand on there. Hang on, let me line it up correctly. There we go. Good boy. I wonder what the anatomy is for like tentacles on his face like that. With horns. I, I wanna get. Whoa. That's so cool. Now, we're going to have some fun with this grab horn and a couple of goblin. Uh, trading posts or camps. Can I? Aww. You cannot enter while. Aww. It's okay, Grab Horn. It's okay. We'll. I'll. <laughs> we'll definitely uh, continue having fun demolishing people later. But for now. Oh, we're just going to witness the pensive memory. We don't have to battle, right? Because I only have three, and I'm out of ancient powers. We're not hardcore battling, right? I mean, I just got done with the grapple one. 
Perhaps Professor Rakham was right to have had faith in you. I still have my reservations. Isadora, as you will see, was not who she seemed. I can only hope that you are. My mm. memories should answer any questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. Thank you, Professor Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. Oh, we really... Oh, no. We're gonna fight, aren't we? I need more potions. Oh! It can't be this easy. It's a trap. It's a trap! It's gotta be. The one who mastered memories. Hey! Oh boy. So now we get the special magic that comes out. Yeah, that special magic thing. Whatever that is. What is that, guys? Let me know in the comments. Hello? Isadora? 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 I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father. Oh, Percival. What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything is much worse than I feared. Neve was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. Oh no. We must gather the others. Isadora, you are meddling with things way too recklessly. Yeah, we're definitely not gonna save. Is that Isadora? I need you to return to your common room, all right? What's the student doing down here? Oh, did Isadora bring him down here? Goblin Silver. Oh, she's got some darkness around her eyes. What have you done? Take a breath. Students, Isadora. Everyone feels pain. And why? Because of your arrogance? Your obsession with secrets? He won't suffer any longer not my father not my students no one Isadora set down your wand professor you taught me to hone my power not throw it away I did not teach you this Expelliarmus <laughs> Well, ooh, that had to hurt. Oh. 
This is before they were unforgivable, though, right? Or they were unforgivable. She's alive. Okay, so that's what happened to Isadora. That question is answered. But, okay. Mm, do what must be done. The map chamber. Okay, okay. So, that happened. But how does that affect what's happening now? That is more, I feel like it's more of a story filler. Unless they tie that into something. Uh, please? The caverns below Hogwarts, where you fought Isadora. Is that the location of the final repository? It is. I called you it. You see, we could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many. So we did all that we could to keep them safe. We also realized that until they could be destroyed, the magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind. Hence, we became keepers. Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us. To allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Ranrock does. You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic. To enter, you must craft a special wand from the four artifacts you found above our pensives. Oh. So the repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. Then I must go now and craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. So we're going to make another wand? I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. I only hope it's not too late. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. All right, Professor. But Black won't listen see you to soon. us, I bet. So... I called it. I knew it. Hey, achievement. Grappling with a grapple. I called it though, the repository is under Hogwarts, and we're gonna either fight in a war or prevent it. And I think we're gonna prevent it, because there was no other big battle of Hogwarts in history. Besides the one with Voldemort. Yeah. That was itchy. Yeah. Okay, so. Uh, meet Poppy. Speak with Natty. Talk to- okay, this one. Oh. Ominous. Well, we're actually going to get the next story here pretty soon, actually. It'll update here in a second. It should. As I leave. There it is. Consult with Ollivander. We're already into this part of the story. Let's just get to the new wand. And then we can test it out on some uh, unsuspecting people. This is going to be cool, though. Should we make, like, the Elder Wand? I think we should. So we have to make a one wand for the specific purpose of. Uh, There's Ollivanders. No, oh, you you I guys just appeared there. The it's wand. like it's magic. Hello, Mr. Ollivander. I wondered if you might be able to help me with something. Yes. Professor Fig sent an owl informing me that you'd be coming. He was a bit cryptic. Said you need to have a special wand crafted. That you'd 
Bring me the materials. Yes, sir. I have them here. Oh, what my. Materials? How extraordinary. Remarkable design. I will be honest, I have never crafted a wand in this fashion. Repaired broken wands, of course, but this is something else entirely. Keeping me on my toes, aren't you? I bit. think I can work with what you've brought me. Let me see what I can do. Do we gotta actually customize it? Oh no, I guess we don't. They're gonna bring this really cool, ancient looking wand out, I assume. Uh oh. It's alive! <laughs> Right? It is done. Let's see what this thing looks like. Does it have like some sort of ancient feel to it? Whoa, is that a clear way? Whoa. I should warn you, I've never seen a one like this before. My suspicion, as Professor Fig implied in his letter, is that it serves a unique purpose. I doubt you shall find much use for it otherwise. I understand. Thank you, sir. That was cool looking. Oh, boy. I'm afraid you're on your own. I've ensured that we have a moment to ourselves. Oh, come, come. No need for such theatrics. In light of what Ranrock now knows, you must agree that our interests are aligned. Our You're interests will never be aligned. You would let goblins take what is rightfully ours? It's no one's. The final repository belongs to wizard kind. It belongs to all the we people be that fools, was taken from. To together. What's that you've got there? Might this sudden visit to the wand maker have something to do with our mutual pursuit? I don't trust you. I have you. no idea what you're talking about. That repository is my birthright. Charles Rookwood wouldn't have wanted you near it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the arrogance. Now I see the conflict. Now I see what he wants. Should have known better than to try and reason with a child. It's all in the I've always said children should be seen and not heard. Wait. He's the one that attacked Anne. Oh! Whoa, he's the one that attacked Anne, not the goblins. Pfft. What? What? I'm sorry. Hello. Are we just going right into battle here? Eat that. I'm done I'm going to regret this. Why is there so many of you? Uh, hey, you. I need more Wigan Wall potions. This is bad. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. Choppers, go, go, go. And you, Cynthia. Thought you had me there. Glaciers. Quick take. Too slow. Love you, Cynthia. Ah, why? Ah! This is so bad. This is so bad. Are you even I don't have any ancient power. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. Nope. Nope. 
Aha! Back for more. Whoa! Defender. Explosive. Spilly on. Bombarder. Huh? Jeez, this is terrifying. Exposer! Oh, how dare you! You cannot control me! Oh. Huh? Oh. Incendio! No incendio, no. Bombarder! Pinfringo! Exposer! Oh. Expelio! Take it! Cup! You're in power! That's oh, shoot! Confringo! No! No! Arrogant uh, wow, there's so many of them. Do I get my... Oh my gosh, I really need to pay attention. Alright, we can do this. I believe... Alright, come on. You there! Oh, how delightful! <laughs> Another pitiful season. What's wrong with you? Where's the execution? Ah! Who's expelling our armors? Can I help? Incendio! Oh my gosh! Explosive! Confringo! Bombarder! Quickly! Incendio! Take it! I'd be impressed by you if I thought so. Aha! Back for more. Knew you were still hanging about. Incendium! Whoa! Incendium! Why? Oh my gosh, I have one health left? Are you kidding me? Exposure! I can show you when I get down from here! Really enjoying the view. I'd like to be put down. Incendium! Oh my gosh, you are the worst. Is that the best you can do? Defender, Gambada. Confringo, Gambada. Expelliarmus. This is so bad. Bombarder. Uh, oh, you. A lamb to the slaughter. Oh my gosh, there's so many of you. I'll make you wish you were back at school. Huh? That's more like it. Uh, I'll certainly move up in Rookwood's ranks after this. Potato! <laughs> You will not survive this fight! Confringo! Defender! Expel the armor! Okay, cabbages. Let's go. Ah, nasty flora! What's this? Got your gun! Bombard! You're going to regret that! I'll certainly put in Rookwood's rank last Oh, those, you're right there. Never did care much for vegetables. Yeah. Fighting with one of your folks on electricity. Move. Oh, that's yeah. super barrel. Oh. Confringo. Now, this is bigger than personal. Oh, but they are. Hey, that's mine. Damn it. I've no patience. Bold and bold. Plants in a jewel. Pathetic. Flash of inspiration. <laughs> Join me. Is it just one of you? Oh my gosh, that was so difficult. Oh heck! Ah! Oh, I didn't realize that was happening. Uh, let's just fight that off a little bit. Let's do holy war top of that. Top of that. Uh, for a child. Are you kidding me? No more happy days for you. Have it just go. Have it patch kids go, please. That was nowhere. Oh my gosh. I need more Wigan World potions. Uh Hang on, I have to redo this. There's no way I can get through multiple rounds of that without more potions. 
Huh? You manipulated me. You'll you answer for this. Oh, I actually didn't use a single wigan World potion that whole time. There's an arrow. Could have done a simple spell. Yeah, I like my stance on this. All right, we're in this. Hold him up, wannabe. Go, 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 go. There we go. For a child. And this is where things get. That doesn't feel good, Rookwood, does it? I'm just warming up. Rookwoods don't go down easy. No, but you don't do anything else easy either, do you? I do this all the hard way, aren't I? I'm gonna see some comment later on that's like, you could have done just done this or use this strategy. Like, you know what? You're probably right, but I'm in the middle of battle. Woo! Good job, thing, aren't you? Fine. Quit flipping out, dude. That's just the beginning. Oh, Do that again, and I'll just like the insect you are. Insect? I thought it was a plant guy. You're only delaying the inevitable. Am I? Victor. You get this? Confringo! Bombarda! Expelliarmus! Oh no you don't! Woo! Woo! Expelliarmus! Confringo! Bombarda! Oh, you took the... You took the brunt for that one. Give me props for that. Oh. Nobody will miss me. That hurt. Oh, there he goes. Bye bye. Ouch. My. Ah! That. Ow. Good for you. Oh my goodness. I just need to use my ancient power on him. Let's get him out of the way. I was so freaking close last time. Ouch. You want some of what she got? Oh my gosh, I'm trying to compensate, but this is so hard to concentrate oh, while I'm commentating. Ouch. Oh, what the love your eyes. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Hello, Inferior. Will you hold still? No. So close. 
Come on, Cabbage Patch Kids. Go, go, go. Stay like that. Just for a little bit. This one loose, and I'd not try. I will use the pendle. Stand and fight me. Come on. Did I get him? Oh my god, don't tell me he has some health left. Ow, you stupid freaking zombie! Confringo! I feel like I've done pretty well so far. Oh, another one. Oh my god. Why do they just keep on coming? Do I literally just have to wait it out? I don't. I can't. What? Incendio! Please! Woman, isn't it? Oh. Power. I need. Okay. Ooh. Real quick, don't go down easy. You'll have to do better than Come on, this, this better end this. There. Oh my gosh. Again? Oh my goodness. Okay. Come on. Come on, Rookwood. Let's finish this. Just you and me. Is he dead? That was difficult. I can't believe it. Rookwood's reign is finally over. Ish. I need to send an Alta Natty right away. For now, though, I need to get back to the map chamber and tell Fig what happened. Hold on, there's a lot of stuff laying around here. Rebellion. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff I need to collect. Oh my gosh, that was so difficult. Where is this? Was that an animal? I don't like the looks of that in camp. Rebellion. I don't like the looks of any of this, but oh my goodness, that oh, another chest. Okay, I think this is the last one, and then we'll head out. Is that it? Okay, map chamber in time. Oh my gosh, I don't want to admit how long that took. The final defend Hogwarts from Ranrock. Oh! <gasps> guys, guys, we're gonna make a side quest here. We're going to <laughs> figure this out. Okay. Whew. Avada Kedavra. Oh boy, let's see what we get ourselves into now mysterious and a bit unsettling let me just save really quickly there we go just in case oh, sebastian we're sebastian gonna have to stop you gone too far you saw what lies in the catacomb i cannot stay here wait Anne, please ominous he was willing to put the whole hamlet and himself in danger on the chance that some old relic could help to heal me i'm sorry ominous 
Make sure he's all right, will you? Oh no. I'm glad you're here. Oh no, we have to stop Sebastian. I received your owl. Where's Sebastian? Inside the catacomb. Frankly, I was surprised you weren't with him. Ominous, I- Stop. You swore you wouldn't let Sebastian take this one step further. Yet here we are. He won't listen to reason. I should have stopped him before. Sebastian's in real trouble now. Yeah. I'm going back into the catacomb to find him. Anne's right. He and the entire hamlet are in danger. The place is crawling with Inferi. Inferi? What are you talking about? You'll see. We need to hurry. Oh boy. Sebastian must not be in his right mind. No, nope, he's definitely not. But we, we just I just got through a major big battle, but we are gonna learn about a cadaver. But if we stop him, how do we actually learn it? Last time we were here, this place was crawling with spiders. We're about to face worse. Let's find Sebastian quickly. I guess we just run through him. Where was Sebastian when you and Anne found him? Just ahead, in the great room. Oh, hello, boys. Let me free them. We're bottom. Ooh. Defender. Bring us. Can I catch kids? You want to help a little bit? Well done. Ooh, ancient power. Don't mind if I do. No, I would press A and press X. Oh. Well, that could have been worse. Sebastian? There weren't this many in theory before. And there's no sign of Sebastian. Hmm. Couldn't bring them. Don't bother. I didn't mean to fall down here. Couldn't bring them. Oh, two for one. That works. Get my ancient meter up. Bombarder. Expelliarmus. Okay, hey, everyone, just chill out for a second. You didn't see that coming. And that was not a blind joke. That time. Defender. 
Ooh, ominous. Nice. Oh. Hold on a moment. I was so worried about Sebastian, I didn't even realize. Anne's gone to get Solomon. When she first saw the Inferi, she thought Sebastian was being attacked. But then he showed her the relic and said he'd learned how to use it. Oh. The carvings on the relic were Inferi. And Sebastian somehow created them. Not exactly. He's controlling them. This is powerful dark magic. Creating in theory is incredibly difficult, but controlling them... As Anne and I frantically barricaded the Inferi to keep them from escaping, Sebastian kept mumbling about healing Anne. When Anne said she couldn't stay here, I didn't realize what she meant. Solomon threatened to go to the headmaster if he heard of Sebastian dealing with dark magic. I need to get to Hogwarts. I must get to Professor Black first. Twist the story a bit, make him think it's a family fight. I'll be back as soon as I can. See if you can talk some sense into Sebastian. Wait, wait, can you teach me about a cadaver before you leave? Be careful. How do we learn? Uh, I have to stop him. Oh. This is... Oh. Hmm. <laughs> oh, more of you. How many inferior are there? Good friend of you. Your Glacius. Levioso. Levioso. Dependo. Bombarda. Confringo. Come on. So Sebastian's trying to attack me since he's controlling all of them, right? Or is it like he doesn't understand uh, like who he's attacking? Ow! Don't get to this there we go. This one. Ooh, that was cool. Oh, Sebastian, Sebastian, Sebastian. Is this the way we need to go? Or is it the other way? Oh, there he is. Oh no, don't. Do we actually even make a bone? Oh my gosh, I hate these bone birds. Once. Mm. Akio. Yeah, I hate these. They break. Guardian Leviosa. Akio. Guardian Leviosa. Guardian Leviosa. Wow. That's simple, huh? Okay, well. Uh, okay, so. Sebastian. Hey, Sebastian. What are you doing, buddy? Come on. Isn't this incredible? Anakin, let her go. Ah. <sighs> Sebastian, I told you, the relic is the answer. Your I've been trying Empire. to reverse the dark magic that injured Anne, but this will allow me to control it. Just as I can control the Inferi. Control? I had to fight the Inferi all the way. What have the two of you done? Accio relic! Grody. You'll pay for this. No, does he use a Vatican ever on him? 
Oh, boy. Wait, wait, why am I? I'm ending this now. Okay, this is bad. Okay, okay, hang on. I have no clue what you saw, man. Why are you attacking me? Solomon, no. Solomon. I do not wish to fight. Now you've gone too far. Bombarder. Confringo. Oh boy. Let me also. Nope. Are you still trying to let me also me? You. Oh, okay, well that works too. Okay, you're one guy. So I can fight all this stuff. Did you stop trying to float me around? Uh, this is one of those things where we just end with Pete Solomon. This doesn't change anything, right? <laughs> Sebastian, that must have hurt. Uh, heal, he. Oh my gosh. Cheap shot. Alright, Solomon. I'm not gonna be nice anymore. I gave you your chance. Isn't this incredible, Sebastian? Alright, you had your chance, Solomon. I am not holding back this time. No more Mr. Nice Guy. Ooh, I can't take that. Sebastian, you got the inferior, right? Ow. Oh, nice job, Sebastian. Oh! Alright, we might have to use it on the back. I feel bad, but I Confringo. sort of don't. You already killed me once. Yup. Revelio. That's not what I meant. Of course. Ah, uh, about that. We did learn some dark magic that you are not going to approve of. Come on, Solomon. Work with me here. We both want to do the same thing. We want to do good. That's not how it works at all. Okay, it works. Now you're the one attacking us, me specifically, for no reason. Move out of the way. Get that for us really quickly. Incendio! Oh! I'm just trying to specifically avoid that. Sorry, you had to be done. Accio! Get some more 
going to power here. Oh! Stopping Sebastian. Sebastian, do you have this? Do you have this? You can hold him out. Yep. Good job, Cabbage Patch. I love you guys. Sorry, you had to be done. Expelliarmus. You took that on the face like a champ, in theory. Yeah, Mr. Salo, we really need you to stop here, dude. Um, things could be end very badly. We are dealing with Anakin here. Good thing there's no younglings around. Oh. Firestorm! What? No! Ooh, this is not bad. This got bad. Say happy birthday to the Earth. Nope. Oh, 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 the fire tornado. Fire tornado. Akira, please, Solomon, listen to me. Who are we to fight? Oh. That's not uh Descender. Confringo. Expelliarmus. Come on, Solomon. Listen to me, dude. Now you've gone too. Oh, firestorm. Whoa. Bombarder. Confringo. Are you not dead yet? Confringo. No firestorm, please. Well, I get it. It's gone right now. Are you? Oh, you're invincible! Because I'm using the wrong spells. That's not what I meant. Oh my gosh, Solomon, you made that so hard. She cannot be healed, Sebastian. You must stop. No, Sebastian, I, don't. I won't let her suffer. No! Ivana Kadabra! Sebastian! Why? You are my brother, Anakin! Oh, why? Sepulto! That was Anne's voice? Yeah. Oh no. Incendio! Sebastian. Whoa. Alright, Anne. <sighs> no, 
Sebastian, what have you done? Order! No! Oh boy. You've made your choice. Ooh. Oh, Anne. Sebastian. What have you done? Uh, trying to stop you, dude. Towards the end. I must get out of here. I can't let him leave. Wait, you need to let him leave, though, right? Just don't chase after Ant. So Ant's all by herself wait. now. Gosh. Sebastian. Stop, Sebastian. Hold on. Why'd you do it? Do you think Solomon was pregnant and uh, is going to have twins after this? Lose the will to live? Oh my goodness. Sebastian, why? Of all the t what is uh, it? We uh, do you want to talk about what just happened? Like at all? Why wouldn't you stop? I was calling after you. Anne won't survive this. She's withering away, inside and out. Solomon's never been there for us. Not really. He gave up on Anne. I'll never give up on her. You saw him, didn't you? He was going to ruin her life. He attacked us. I... I had to use the killing curse. You know I did. To if I hadn't known how to cast it, right. it. Oh. We have to encourage it to learn it, don't we? Uh, my thing would be in all actuality, no one should know this curse. But I want to learn this curse. Ugh. He did attack us. You had no choice. It was mm. brave, Sebastian. You clearly care more about Anne than your uncle ever did. Oh, I, I don't like that understand. at all. I did do the right thing. No. You did. I would have done the same. If I knew how. I could teach you. Yes, please. No time like the present. The killing curse won't be easy to master. As with all unforgivables, you have to mean it. <laughs> I hated my dialogue Hold your there. one steady. Focus. The incantation is Avada Kedavra. Your intention must be clear. Oh... I hated my own dialogue there. But I want to learn this curse. It'll really help with some bosses, I think. I can't stay here. I need to find Ominous. Sebastian, please. I'm not myself right now. You were Let's not yourself later. at all lately. The Undercroft, all right? Ah, oh, Sebastian. But we learned about a cadaver. That works. Yes. Kills, like, any enemy instantly? I need to use it on a troll. Oh, Sebastian. <sighs> Alright, guys. Oh, Sebastian. He truly was Anakin. He went too far to the dark side. And, oh, okay. I wish I could apparate. <sighs> Alright, guys. I'm going to wrap things up there. If you enjoyed the video, click on that subscribe button so you never miss an upload, and I'll see you next time.